Alrighty, everybody, and yo! What is going on, everybody? It's Super Mario Nickel Death K here on YouTube, and today in this video, I'm going to be doing another Rise and Fall video, and today, actually, it's not even a rise. This is the downfall of Joseph in SML. I still don't believe Joseph has ever been in a point where he has been in a rising point. I think he's always... Just been falling down ever since he got into SML. I think the moment he got in was at his best, and then it just went downhill from there. And that's what I'm going to be talking about in today's video. Joseph completely collapsed, collapsed as a character, and I think it's just ridiculous how far he's gotten from his old self. And it's disappointing. So I'm going to be going over Joseph's downfall in SML. So if you guys are going to go on to enjoy, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel. And without further ado, guys. Let's get right on to it. Now, way back when, and I'm talking way back when, like back in 2014 when Joseph was introduced into SML. Well, actually, he was introduced before as Bowser's minion, but we're not really going to look at that Joseph. We're going to look at the Joseph, the Joseph, his friend from school, Joseph. Now, originally, Joseph was just supposed to be a, a, a guy who was really just giving Black Yoshi a run for his money in Call of Duty. And he was just a cool kid, and ever since he came into summer school, he kind of portrayed himself as one of the cool kids. He always hang out with, he always hung out with guys like Tanner, who are also super cool. And Joseph was just really a cool guy, and that kind of stigma was what led Joseph to be a pretty successful introductory character. Again, I feel like a lot of people liked Joseph at that point. I think it was pretty cool to see. Again. Joseph was always the guy who was one-upping Junior, making fun of him, acting like the tough guy. It was all great. And even after summer school, Joseph was still a fairly, fairly cool character. And again, it was always in those videos. I mean, Junior Joseph and Cody would have a sleepover, for example, and Joseph would always be the cool guy who wasn't scared of the scary channel, for example. He was just really cool and was never phased by anything. And I think that's kind of what a lot of people liked about Joseph. Is that he was the cool guy from the group and jo Junior was somewhat of a chicken but not quite as chicken as Cody. And Joseph kind of brought a new dynamic whereas now he just kind of feels like a very, 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 very shitty Junior. And I, I don't know, that, that maybe that's just me but I feel like Joseph really doesn't really have that much of a role in the Junior trio. Before, he used to add a dynamic but now I just don't really see that to be the case. But when Joseph came into SML, a lot of people really liked him such as myself. They thought he bought a cool dynamic and they wanted him to stay in videos, but this was good for about two years and then this is where we really start to see the downfall of Joseph in SML. Now a lot of people want to give Joseph, Joseph shit for his appearances in 2016 and like his whole dead mom jokes and all that and I actually don't think that's that bad. I think it's really not about that when it comes to Joseph. I think Joseph's actually been a solid character until 2017. I know a lot of people like to give Joseph shit for his 2016 performances, but I really do believe that 2017 was the point where he started to fall, and it's not really 2016's fall. I think he was pretty good in 2016. SML started ruining the Joseph character by simply just taking him down one piece at a time. He went from being, yeah, kind of cool and all this, and, you know, yeah, a lot of people didn't like that whole transition to finding out that Joseph was completely poor and broke, but a lot of people still really found that as a positive and found that they could maybe relate to Joseph a little bit better and found that he was a bit more funny. But I think things go way too far in videos like Joseph moves in and he just kind of shows a dark side of him or videos like J Joseph's uh, imaginary girlfriend or like the paper, you know, the video where they turn into paper and he has a paper girlfriend named Paige. I feel like those are videos that take it way too far with Joseph. And that was the first big mistake on Logan's part. They took his character way too far. In this character, I mean, this was the video that pretty much destroyed Joseph's character and was ruined and started the complete downfall trend of Joseph was the video where he moved in because it showed an entire scary part of Joseph that nobody really wanted to see or ever thought that they were gonna see. And I don't know, I just really, really couldn't ha wrap my head around it. And I just really hated every second of it. But even with that said, that's not all the extremities and problems of Joseph. In fact, I've barely covered the surface of the problems with Joseph right now. Man, the downfall of Joseph is insane. 
It's insane, okay? And it's not even about the fact that they made him way, way, way too crazy. It, 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 it started with the red shell, man. It honestly started with the red shell. When, when he got to the red shell, sure, he was no longer as crazy as he was before. But at that point, he was acting like completely cocky and nobody liked it. Joseph was the most cocky person at that point that I think I ever seen in my entire life incredibly cocky person um i don't believe that joseph is a very I, I don't know there's something about joseph that there's a problem with when he broke his red shell in joseph's red shell or in this case of joseph's new shell well instead of titling the video joseph's new shell title it joseph's new personality because they just completely changed the character he turns into this cocky guy because he has all of a sudden these ideas that oh yeah i can fly now because he gets a red shell with wings which is kind of like supposed to imitate the paratroopa whatever they were called paracoopa paratroopa i'm not exactly sure in the mario titles but this was a problem because he just got cocky and for the next like seven months he was just non-stop cocky and it got to a point where it was just awful to watch and not only this but cody was out at this point and with Cody being out due to quarantine, it meant that Joseph needed an even bigger role. And with Joseph needing an even bigger role, well, that means there was more and more room for disaster. And that's kind of what happened as we take a stroll to a video called Joseph the Millionaire. In my opinion, and I know I've said this throughout three, four videos in this video, I genuinely believe that this is the video where Joseph's character got completely ruined. Look, Joseph's red shell made him be a complete, like, dick, I'm gonna be honest, but it doesn't even compare to what is being seen here, and this video is, it's just nuts, um, I don't know why, I still need clarification on Logan's part, why did he do this? Because I don't understand why ruin someone's character. People like the fact that Joseph's poor. They got used to it. Now you have to completely readapt everything and reevaluate everything. When I do my tier list, for example, and if I'm doing it based on how rich or poor characters are, I have no idea if Joseph's rich or poor. I have no idea. Do I say he's poor or do I say he's rich? The SML universe knows that Joseph is poor, but what the SML universe doesn't know is that Joseph is actually rich because he erased that, you know, time that Junior went to his house. He erased it from our memories. And we still remember as viewers, but anyone in SML has no idea. And they've never made any Joseph poor jokes recently, but this is the video that killed the character because at this point now he doesn't make any sense. And this is where things really just completely begin to tumble. And it doesn't even help when his puppet gets introduced and that's also what helps contribute it to the point where joseph's not even a top 10 not even a top 15 sml character anymore when joseph's puppet got introduced people honestly hated him and people hated him more than he was hated before and while people hated his personality a lot of people didn't like the puppet they didn't like the look of it as that kind of was a given for Junior Joseph Cody. Literally everyone that got a puppet, nobody liked them. Um, but we've just gotten used to them, and I honestly do like them now. I think they're pretty intricate designs, and I think they really accurately demonstrate each character. But I think when it comes to Joseph in particular, people didn't really like the design of the puppet. I thought it was pretty good. I really did. I thought it was accurate to what Joseph is. But a lot of people didn't like it, and mixed with the way he was acting, it was just a horrible one-shot scene. Um... Good news is, though, this is about as bad as it gets for Joseph. Because from this point forward, Joseph, people start forgetting about, you know, all the drama that happened with Joseph, all the rich, poor drama that happened. And people start remembering Joseph for what he was back in the day. And people are starting to like Joseph more. Even after the quarantine phase and things were, you know, slowly starting to brush up and Cody came back in SML, things got a little bit better for Joseph. But I will say, Jeff, Joseph definitely had one of the biggest down points of any SML character I've ever seen. If there was a graph for every SML character, Joseph would tank like it's nothing. At one point, he'd tank completely. He's slightly coming back up now, but he'd tank completely. And... There's just nothing to say about it. He's gotten better. People are enjoying him more. I'm enjoying him more. I think he's back to a top 10 caliber character, but that's about it for Joseph. He still has a long way to go, but this is kind of where he stands. I've been liking him recently. So anyway, that is the video. I feel like Joseph is definitely staged for a good return, 
but his past was just horrible and as a character he reached one of the lowest lows i could possibly imagine so anyway that is the video i hope y'all enjoyed if you did please drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel and comment down below which character you want to see next peace out everybody